Hi, I'm Dr. William Anderson. I'm a uh, assistant professor of neurosurgery at the Johns Hopkins School of Medicine. Uh, I treat mainly patients with uh, epilepsy and then a variety of conditions uh, that we refer to as movement disorders, uh, things like Parkinson's disease, essential tremor, and dystonia. Uh, my specialty is uh, uh, referred to as functional neurosurgery because uh, our work is guided by an effort to try to increase uh, uh, the patient's function uh, under, uh, under the course of a variety of uh, uh, neurodege neurodegenerative uh, uh, conditions or, or epilepsy specifically. Uh, my research also deals uh, primarily with epilepsy. I use uh, computer models to try to understand how seizures uh, begin in a patient's brain and how they evolve to affect large regions of the patient's brain. And then we use these same computer models to study different therapies that we can attempt to use to stop seizures from spreading. And I, I love my field because Epilepsy specifically affects patients who are really at a time in their life when they're starting school, when they're trying to find jobs, uh, generally uh, younger adults, uh, at crucial moments in their life and they're affected by seizures and, and they're having difficulties trying to find jobs or, or staying in school. And we, we try to put them back on their course in life uh, to try to give them uh, uh, a better future. And uh, th this requires actually a very interesting assortment of physicians all working together, uh, including neurologists, uh, neurosurgeons, uh, neuropsychologists, and psychiatrists. Uh, and we work as a team, a multidisciplinary team, uh, both in the field of epilepsy to try to figure out whether surgery would be a good option for a given patient, uh, and also in the field of movement disorders uh, where we typically use deep brain stimulation uh, to help our patients. And these teams uh, go through the pros and cons of different surgical therapies uh, to try to come up with the best treatment plan uh, for the patients. And I, I think that really guides my philosophy of care as well. Uh, we uh, uh, approach all angles of a patient's needs and a patient's disease state, and we try to come up with a plan that will best benefit the patient.